Python is a popular programming language, and it's also really powerful. Aside from me getting feather dusted by my dog, Rupert, today I'm gonna show you my top five picks for free Python courses in 2024. Let's get to it. Welcome to Real Tough Candy, your destination for software education information. Let's kick it right off. First on my list for best Python course in 2024. It's called Future Coder over on futurecoder.io. Let's face it, there are plenty of options out there for interactive coding editors, but I feel like this one in particular does have a few features that go above and beyond. Now, aside from the fully immersive and interactive coding environment, you get some debuggers, enhanced error messages, and then we get to the really good stuff, the stuff that kind of activated my inner call stack. In this context, if you're having Having a problem with the problem, can't figure it out, and you're stuck, exhausted all the hints, you can try putting the shuffled solution in the correct order instead. So you're getting the answer, but you're also working for the answer. And I thought that was really cool. I have not seen the Parsons problems implemented in any other platform. They may be out there, but I haven't seen them. The other thing I really like too are the solution breadcrumbs. As a last resort, you can gradually reveal the solution until you have enough info to fill in the remaining gaps. Futurecoder.io is absolutely geared towards beginners, whether you're a completely new Python programmer or just new to programming in general. Let's hop into these lists. Up top is where you're gonna be doing your coding, and then beneath is where you're gonna get your output. So if I run this right now, nothing's gonna happen. And if I just type some gobbledygook, as it's technically known, we can run it. On the left side over here, we have our actual lesson, along with some requirements, the assessment and hints and solutions for those lovely breadcrumbs and Parsons problems if you get stuck. This app was created by Alex Hall. He has a YouTube channel. Give him a shout out if you run into him on the interwebs. Tell him RTC sent you. Great job, Alex. I love this thing. It has everything I'm looking for in an interactive coding environment, as well as just a general educational environment. Next on my list of best free Python courses is CS50's Introduction to Programming with Python. Those spidey senses and those antennae might be raising and getting a little activated right now because CS50 is a product of Harvard. Yes, that Harvard. On one hand, this is a video-based course, but on the other hand, there are some extensions and opportunities for you to go fully immersive with it. What's cool about this course is that you're not only learning Python, but you're also learning about programming principles because note the title, Introduction to Programming with Python. This is a great course for people who are new to programming in general. However, if you do have some programming experience and wanna learn Python, I think this is also a great course. The video runtime is nearly a whopping 16 hours, which on one hand is kind of a lot, but on the other hand, I've seen courses that are like 60, 70 video hours. There are a few ways to access this course. The first one is through Free Code Camp. Also, Harvard's website has this course broken down into smaller chunks. And within these modules, you just get segments of the videos. You have some Google Slides, the PDF, source code, subtitles, transcripts, and then they even have code spaces built for CS50, built for this course. And basically what this is, is an interactive coding environment so you can code along or pause the video and try it out yourself. Code Spaces is free for the first 60 hours of use. Third on my list for best free Python courses is brought to us by Free Code Camp and Kylie Ying. She's going to be showing you how to construct 12 Python projects. What I like about this course is that it's project packed, as you can see by the title. The other thing I really enjoy about this course too is the instructor, Kylie. She's really engaging. You can tell she took a lot of time to construct this course and she's not putting you to sleep. At the same time, it's not fluff, like you're actually doing 12 Python projects. Some of the projects you will be doing include Mad Libs, Guess the Number, Rock, Paper, Scissors, Hangman, Tic-Tac-Toe, Binary Search, Minesweeper, and a few more. Markov Chain Text Composer, ooh, yeah. They do give the disclaimer, it would be helpful to have a bit of Python knowledge before starting this course. Really fun course here, and 12 Python projects under one roof. I mean, come on. Number four on my list for best free Python course is called simply Learn Python. This is on a platform called Scrimba. This platform is awesome. It's so interactive. You can pause the video as they're coding on the video and code over their code. Right? I know it's 
it's freaking cool. This is a beginner friendly course as well. It's 58 parts. Since this is a beginner friendly course, not really a lot of surprises going over the curriculum. Print statement with program flow, variables, data types, and typecasting, going down to user inputs and lists, split and join, sets and exercises, functions, while loops, even going over some Lambda functions, and even getting into some projects down here, a crypto machine, math tutor, a trading game, and more. Popping in to the data types and typecasting lesson, this is actually a video player right here so let me play it for just a second you can see he's the guy coding right here and explaining it or single quotes they are equal in value. however once i pause the video i can go in and say hello hello and it takes my input like what and now i can run it sorry to geek out so bad here i'm mashing the keys and i couldn't be more pleased about it really fun and really engaging again this course is simply called learn python on scrimba.com number five on my list definitely not beginner friendly definitely a mind blower for my advanced programmers this one's called mastering algorithms for problem solving in python this is on educative.io now they say it's intermediate <laughs> I'm going to disagree on that. I think this is an advanced course. They say it'll take about 28 hours. Verdict's still out on that one, but I will say even just going through the first lesson, I was reading for about two hours just because they do give you the history of algorithms. And as someone like me who is circling back into applied math, this stuff is not an easy read. So there is reading. Let me actually go in here and I'll show you what this looks like. So it starts off with what is an algorithm. Now, under normal circumstances, it would be a couple of sentences, but no, they actually throw a bottle of beer algorithm at you straight away with code that you can run and it will run right in your browser no setup required but this is the python implementation of the song 99 bottles of beer on the wall then it goes on to multiplication algorithms a lot of reading a lot of formulas just the introduction section of this course is rocking my world i dare not even go down to the greedy algorithm and dynamic programming sections because i'm still caught up on lattice multiplication to be honest and these formulas really rock in my world in in the introductory section, they do have these coding editors. You can run the code, you can save it and reset it. There are also periodic assessments in this course. So after the first five chapters, they throw a 30 minute or so assessment on you. And then they go to the basic graph algorithms, depth first, search, minimum spanning trees, shortest paths, all pairs, shortest paths, and then a course assessment. And there you have it for 2024, my top five picks for best free Python courses developers. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, do me a favor, smash that thumbs up button. I'm RTC from Real Tough Candy, your destination for software education information, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah.